camera shy today and I don't really know why but I'm gonna have to get over it because after today I have work like five billion days in a row so here goes I'll edit out the awkwardness hey um here's what's been going on so obviously I've known where I'm gonna go to university since January but they don't know who's coming until August so I feel like I applied and then nothing happened and then now everything is happening because it's post results day like this week I got my academic tutor, welfare tutor, my college family, my accommodation release. So that's where we're at. Um, what's happening now? I... let's get a planner out. I have this list of things I need to do pre-Cambridge because it's hit me like it's a month away. And I've been at home for five months and I've not done anything, I've just had fun. Here's our ongoing list. Some of the things I can't really do, like buy a bike. I can barely ride a bike so I'm not doing that. But, like some of the other stuff I can do. So we're going to try and do some items on this list and also Natsuki is a course has prep work it's 10 hours a week plus three hours of online lectures so I'm going to try and do as much of this week's work as possible today. Thinking about it now though like if I do 10 hours of work in one day is that really an exciting vlog? No. Whatever what if what if what if I just do it in an hour because I'm just so cool and clever? Not gonna lie, guy, I'm getting a bit fed up of doing 10 million bits of trivial algebra. So I am typing all of these simultaneous equations into all from alpha. A is minus two, B is one, C is one. Let's be real, like, I can do simultaneous equations and I've got shit to do. So do I feel guilty? No. Smashed it. Shout out to all from alpha. I am doing a bit, like, you know, I'm pulling a bit of the weight, just not all of it. And that's an important life lesson. Sometimes we need to reach out to others for help and we shouldn't be ashamed. Nobody shame me, okay? I got in, that was the hardest part. <laughs> okay. Watery wee parcel from Emmanuel College. Okay, cool. That's a letter, Fresh's week timetable, Fresh's guide. Another freshers guide. I don't need that much guidance. Health and safety, classic. Domestic matters. College regulations. This is getting boring already. Map. And I need to get meningitis vaccine. Oh, and mumps and measles, and tuberculosis, and COVID-19. Right, let's add into the planner list. Read freshers pack. We'll do that later. Read. Fresh. We're double parked. I know, we're just getting a bit too crazy today. Let's get back into it. <laughs> Okay, we're 
back at the desk, I'm gonna try and speed run through all of the items on the to-do list that I think are gonna take like less than 15 minutes. Just get them out of the way. First up, I need to submit an early move-in request. I'm gonna use it off camera because I don't want you to steal my information. So I'll come back in a sec. Okay, form completed. The test was pretty easy. So if I got four marks. Um, I just got emailed my payslips for both my jobs and last month because I was away. I earned like £600 total. That's pretty trash. I was like, not even three weeks worth of rent. And now we're going to go shopping. The stuff that I can definitely buy online, which I'm going to do now, are calculator. Full size tripod, water bottle, and then an outfit for dresses your subject. Got big plans for that. Let's do calculator first because that's the most boring. I think there are like specs. There's obviously going to be a spec. <laughs> for that we're gonna read this parcel that my college sent me this morning i'm gonna take some notes because i'm a good student and we're gonna listen to some music what do we want today gang we need some jazz I just got out of the bath. I had an everything bath. I shaved my whole body. I washed my hair. I feel incredible. I've already done my bronzer and my highlight, by the way. I don't look like this, actually. Um, we're going to get ready to go out now. The theme for tonight is black and white. So makeup wise, definitely feeling a smoky eye. I think it's the only option we have. I've had a bit of a problem outfit wise because essentially I've lost some of my clothes. I don't really understand how because I was preparing to go on holiday and obviously I washed loads of my clothes and I vividly remember putting these clothes in the washing machine, washing them, taking them up, putting them in the tumble dryer, especially I remember ironing them. And then I got to Indonesia and I opened my suitcase and I was missing loads of things like my favourite black trousers is the one that's the issue, my linen trousers, a skirt, two polos, a swimming costume, I don't know where they've gone and then I came home, I tore apart the no, what? I tore apart the whole house looking for them. I don't know where they've gone and I only have one pair of black trousers and they're my work trousers so it's a bit of an issue and I would have really liked them for tonight and they've gone missing so we're gonna have to wear a black mini skirt which I hadn't mentally prepared for thus the emergency shave so this makeup is really gonna have to be good to make up for it I have faith I have faith okay one eye done I think we're making it out of this alive the second one's always the worst one though. Okay. All finished, here's the final makeup. Pretty simple, but you know, just a job. Let me go and dry my hair and then we'll strain it, then we'll get changed, then we're ready to go.
Okay, we're back home. This is the best part of any day, which is the post-club late night snack. We're having apple strudel and ice cream. My mother made the apple strudel. Made with love. Tastes 10 times better. This is delicious. Um, we got kicked out of the club. Whoops. Not my fault, my I add. I don't know if we've been through this, but I don't drink anymore. I don't do anything. I'm completely 100% healthy. It's not a forever thing, it's a temporary thing, because let's be real, Cambridge Freshers, I probably need a bit of something. And it's times like this, where it's 1am and I've come home and I'm stone cold sober. I've worked tomorrow for 11 hours, I am so glad I don't drink. Because I've been sick in that work toilet before and it's not happening again, okay? That is like the pits of hell. Anyway, the point is, everything is aligning, I'm home early, I'm sober, I'm ready to go to bed. This is what being an adult is. Good job, me. Um, I'm gonna say goodnight now because I can't look when I'm upstairs because everyone else is sleeping. So, goodnight. Thanks for. Sorry, I just burped in your face. Thanks for joining me. Tune in again next time. Mwah.